Hey guys, Mixed Media Girl here. So today we're going to do a leftover paint pour. And what I do is basically after I do a, a flip cup or tree ring or something, you're always gonna have a little bit of paint left in your cup after you do that. So I just combine all of the leftover paints of cup, uh, paints in the cups, um, by putting them on top of each other like this. And that not only keeps them from drying out, but then it lets them drain into each other. So you get kind of a, a mixture of paints. This one I'm a little concerned about because I used the Deco Art pouring medium a few times in the last week and it separates from the paint, unlike Floetrol. So I'm a little interested in how this one's gonna come out, but let's give it a go. I'm gonna do a tree ring. So in here we have Artist Loft Flow Acrylics. We have multiple kinds of Deco Art paint. We've got metallics. Um, as you can see, mostly blues and purples and whatnot. But uh, there was definitely gold and black. Let's see. So yeah, I'm kind of curious about this. Especially this paint on the bottom here. Looks like it might be a little more kind of clumpy than usual. But we're going to just go with it and see what we get. And this paint's been sitting here, I'd say not more than like a couple weeks. So it hasn't been that long. This stuff around here is the newer paint. This stuff would be older. So see how that's not moving right there? That's because that's like a clump in there. Which I'm going to see actually if I can, without damaging anything. Yeah. It's just like thick paint. It's not, uh, it's not something I can actually even grab and take out. So we're just going to have to work with it. It's going to just be a part of the painting, and that's okay. I'm definitely liking these colors in here. Yeah, there's deco art fluid acrylics in here. There's all kinds of paints. So with these golds, it truly looks like a slab of stone. That's awesome. Cool. Okay, let's go ahead and we'll let this sit, see what develops, and then we'll go in and do our close-up. All right, we're back. So we do have a lot of, uh, some cells popping up, and there's no silicone in this paint. I know that for, well, I'm 99.9.999% .9 sure. That was a little too many points. But um, there are a lot of metallics. And this gold and the blue, there's a metallic blue, metallic purple, gold. Those tend to create a lot of cells. Anyway, so let's go ahead and do our close-up. So here is the bottom right corner. I love this. If I could have a whole painting that just looked like this, that would be awesome. I do want to show you over here on the sides. You'll see the paint's kind of breaking up a little, which is unusual. Um, I think that's just because with the paint sitting here, it, uh, it's been kind of breaking down. So I, it seems like the leftover paint with the Deco Art pouring medium does not last as long as the leftover paint with Floetrol. Here's the upper right hand corner. And guys, sorry about all those motorcycles. It's the weekend. <laughs> Here's the upper left hand corner. And then also the lower, the lower left hand corner, beautiful.
All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this. Um, definitely save your leftover paint and use it for some fun stuff like this. And uh, for the next week or so, you'll be getting a lot of videos from Vegas, going to Artisan Summit. It's going to be a blast, and I will see you next time.